Joining us, we begin with a Channel 3 exclusive. Yeah, the CEO of the Cleveland Metropolitan School District has announced to 3 News that there's a new decision on the controversial funding debate as to whether students can vote on where money from a generous donation can be spent. And tonight we go right to the source. CEO Dr. Warren Morgan, education reporter Danielle Wiggins, sat down with him for an exclusive interview. Good morning. Just hours after CMSD CEO Dr. Warren Morgan heard this at a school board meeting. How long are you going to keep us in the darkness with your false lies? And two days after he heard this at a meeting with city council. But we have been misled, we have been lied to, and we've been used. Morgan sits down with me exclusively to talk about what's transpired the last couple of days. Yeah, the past two days are always challenging, but what I hear, even aside of all of the uh, what could appear to be arguing, is I hear passion. He shares his regret of not talking to students first before deciding to end the CMSD Get More Opportunities grant funding program. So that was a, a miss on my part, but you learn from it. Morgan says by the spring, he hopes to have an idea of what the revamp program will look like. It was initially funded by a $20 million gift from philanthropist Mackenzie Scott. If you could put a percentage on it, how likely is it that that $17 million that's left of the Mackenzie Scott donation will be transferred back to some, as your words, repurposed uh, form of that program? Um, so right now we're looking into all the opportunities uh, for that. Uh, a, a few things I, I want to say, even just with your question, I would even just say 100% likely uh, because it was always in the general fund. Even when we uh, made the decision to pause the program, and 3 News just got off the phone with a representative from CMSD, and they want to clarify, saying that there has been no decision on the amount of the money that will be put back into the revamp program. So, Russ, I guess we will have to continue to wait to see the specifics of how this all unfolds. Yeah. But we mm -hmm. had a wide-ranging interview, and it's, his full answer is on WKYC.com, sure. as well as the full interview. The headline there is there has been a change, certainly, in what they were saying the other day. Let me ask you now about the teachers' negotiations. Mm -hmm. Those are coming up. What did Dr. Morgan say about that? Well, the teacher negotiations, their contract is up June 30th, and now he couldn't talk specifically about the negotiations, but he does say that he feels that they're going well and that they're on pace. Okay. Danielle Wiggins, thank you.